I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? Hey guys, it's Sheila and welcome to Making It in Australia. And by now you should have watched my house tour guys. Ta-da! <laughs> anyway, so our vlog for today is gonna be the plant tour. So about our when did we start our clan obsession? Right, so it started with this one. You can't see me now. You're a wild guess about this plant. If it's not common, I'm gonna introduce you to our very first Monstera deliciosa. Wow. So our first plant is a monstera and yes guys um at first um ruel bought this one because when he first bought it it was damaged and it's this um one leaf right here but he was thinking that um it was the only leaf that has patterns so the rest is just like this it's like simple nothing so just plain leaves like this and then it grew so this is our six month old monstera deliciosa so hopefully i can zoom to the right light so from this branch right here it grew up and push another uh, another stem and then grew and grew and now there's a bud coming out so look at that the pattern on this leaves is like amazing so i'm really excited about that one so naka happy lang and then it grew from there like the love or plants eventually like add kami nang nag add we added a lot of stuff um a lot of um plants and now this is it so before anything else i'm gonna start somewhere that is not new but of course we're gonna do a two parts plant house tour plant house tour plant tour so this is a part one which is the first floor of the house and i'm gonna show you the rest on the next vlog please do click the like button share this vlog and also subscribe to the channel guys to join the me fam if i call it like making it in australia fam okay wow just a disclaimer guys <laughs> i am not really well versed into this plant whole plant um interplant thingo but as you may already know i love planting flowers before before i get into this obsession if you guys um know the plants and you think that i'm wrong please comment down below and i really appreciate the feedback so first up we are at the home office Ta -da! yes and see We've got some plants over here. Alrighty guys, I'm gonna start the house plant tour at the home office with this plants right here and moving down to here to this too and sorry for the background because this is where the place where we repot like this one. This is our begonia rex. So as you can see, nice on foliage. Um, it has like a silvery type of um, foliage. So I love it. This is our first begonia. So hopefully we do this justice. Because at this point guys, we, we bought this. It was this bloom already. So I'm hoping that I'm going to see new growths. And hopefully it will grow bigger and fuller by the time comes. So yeah. I'm hoping to get some opinions from you guys. If you've got any um, growing tips, let me know down in the comments. And the next one is Defenbachia 
star bright so this one is super pretty look at that white pattern in the middle and like a splash of green before it moves to the greener part darker portion so yeah life and back yeah guys look at that look at me i'm so so proud <laughs> i'm learning these things yay now, <laughs> the bottom one we've got a ficus burgundy so this one i still have to figure it out because sometimes i feel like we we have a lot of ficus because if you follow me on instagram i've done a photo there that it shows our ficus collection and this ficus right here we bought this first out of that group or of that collection and we put the ficus here but it hasn't grown like i don't know if we're doing something wrong with it but yeah i'm still figuring that out maybe we should repot it and change the soil that could do some trick isn't it this beautiful baby right look at that this is one of my favorites Ooh, this is a philodendron sanadu yes oh so pretty look at green right okay so at first royal was quite hesitant to get that plant because i don't know he doesn't like the shape or um we're not really um seeing things that were really into philodendrons but yeah after we, i bought that one i was so super happy i just left it in a pot for quite a while and it's now giving us new buds oh my god guys this is new this is super new um where's the other one this one's quite new as well this new leaf sorry if it's dark yeah this new leaf is just grown for uh, like weeks from now and as you can see there's another one. Oh my god i'm so happy the next one is a philodendron pink princess look at that it's not as pink as the um the one that you see in photos or in pictures but yeah it's getting there medyo ano pala sila no medyo tricky sila alagan because you know as a new plant mama you tend to water a lot and I always do that so most of the time I'm gonna overwater Kusila and I thought that they're not growing well but now that we're getting to warmer seasons and summertime they're really giving us new buds so right there and they're kind of for me kind of weird in a way because um, they've been shooting out some new leaves and then there's another one coming out the next uh, that same branch so it's amazing I don't know I'm, I'm so amazed with it but yeah we're super happy and that's it for the home office let's go now let's proceed to the kitchen area we're here at the kitchen area and look at that this is our plants right here this is our golden photos it's not it's not as um, evident yet it doesn't have a lot of variegations yet not variegations um, the foliage is not as evident as it's golden i don't know why but this one is just thriving here it doesn't seem look this is normal light guys right this one has a bit of um like evident foliage of golden color and this one is our peace lily right this used to be in this is used to be in the master's bedroom but Ruel move it out because he's planning to get another variety of peace lily so surprise surprise moving on to our sala you are center table here at the lounge so this one this spot right here it's so pretty it's actually worn out now na like fade na yung color in ng pot um, but this is a gift actually from Ate Ron and Kuya Ken. Thank you so much. It's actually a wedding gift last year and I don't know, I'm not into succulents guys. I'm so sorry. So, so succulent lovers right there. I'm so sorry. But the story is, the one that they gifted to us, everything died. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I feel bad. But 
luckily enough, I have a friend, Ati Jen, shout out Ati Jen, that she's really into succulents, so she planted new ones. So this is still her plants, so they're thriving. Well, not really. I burnt them, so it's not as pretty. But yeah, if you've got some succulent tips from me, guys, let me know. Because wala na si Ati Jen, wala na nag-aalaga <laughs> ito kasi she's in Sydney. And this one is from her as well. This is a shade plant. As far as I know, money, money plant, money tree. Animation <laughs> of the plant tour. We are now at the buffet table area. So we've got this lucky bamboo. And I don't know this plant, guys. I think it's a syngonium, but I don't know the um variety or the specific name for it if you know let me know at the comments down below next to it is a ficus um yellow yellow gem yeah this one too it's quite big now when you purchase it but we don't know what's happening apparently it's shooting out some small leaves um unlike the other ficus that we have upstairs that's our really Driving, really love the loves the light, but yeah. So far, he's he's still okay there. So I guess we're not gonna change the spot yet. Next to it is the Tradescantia sabriana. Look at that, the foliage of this it's so pretty, guys. And I'm gonna show you this one. Look at the back. Oh my. Now it's shooting up new roads in the middle, so we're happy. It's really thriving there, guys. Low light lang siya, so that's good. Next to it is our Agunima Fam. Now we're really into this one. So it's it's kind of nice. Um, this one is the Red Valentine. I think I purchased this in Sydney, and now it's shooting up new buds. I'm so happy. Look at that. Next to it is the Adlonema Star Shining. So guys, if I'm naming it wrong, please let me know, huh? I think it's Star Shining because we look it up in Google. So look at that. Look how pretty it is that. And next to it, on a small pot, is our Siam Aurora. This one, maybe it took a while. It took a while to grow, to add some new leaves, but it's now getting to it this one was cut but I don't know what happened but there it's shooting out some new growths I think it's happy there now with the Aglonima fam and so that's it down to the buffet table is our I call this our hello hello pot or mix pot this is the Drakenia fam guys Ta -da! Drakenia fam so this is a happy plant and this is a marginata it's so beautiful i love the pinkish edges and this one is a cordyline pink cordyline it's actually two but the other one i don't know what happened i think there's some mealy bugs in the middle so we had to cut it off and then yeah we just Ruel just joined everything together Having a plant papa in the house is so handy. Yeah! 